The world we live in is changing faster than expected, and we need to be confronting this change. We need to be making sense of this change. The Environmental Humanities Initiative is, I hope, a dynamic intervention on campus to really integrate ecology, scholarship, and the arts. One of the problems we continue to face over and over again is that it's an issue that we understand primarily through a scientific framework, and yet it's an issue which cannot be addressed primarily through a scientific framework. It's a political issue, it's a social issue, it's a cultural issue, it's an issue of justice, it's an issue, it's a philosophical issue. And so there is a deep, deep need to bring together science and the humanities and the arts and the social sciences and really work to put them into dialogue, to integrate them and to find ways to work across the disciplinary boundaries that keep apart these different, these different kinds of knowledge. And that is what the environmental humanities can provide. There's an emphasis on the spirit here, on the soul, on the character of the community that's inflected by a concern for social justice and inflected by the focus on integral ecology and ethics and compassion that we see in Pope Francis's 2015 encyclical Laudato Si. The possibility of that document and its ethical approach percolating through and influencing the way that Notre Dame can create a space for this conversation and open up this research and reach students. Notre Dame, given its Catholic character and given its commitment to the humanities, has a unique role to play in leading national conversation and international conversation on how we bring those issues to bear on climate change.